Dose the worst, bitch. Please remember, Dose is the worst. <laughs> Dude, shit. What the fuck? Watch out, this guy's coming at me with a fucking bottle, dude. Bye bye. Bye bye. I don't, I don't, yeah. Anyways, I'll so Do you regret saying that shit? Or do you feel like that's, you know, I, I feel like you probably accepted that was a mistake to accept Who, that. me? Yeah, yeah, about the, like, sexual... No, no, I said that maybe we don't know. Maybe it but was that, consensual. That, that, that doubt that is cast is, like, part of the, like, dominant sort of... Narrative. You think so? Well, I don't know. All I know is I wasn't there, you weren't there, yeah. I didn't vote for Trump, I don't like Trump, but I offered, like, because they're calling people rapists and rape apologists, yeah. and I said, well, maybe you weren't there, you don't know what the fuck happened. So, and no, also, like also... Women. And no, he, like, I mean, the, the, the footage that's there of him, like, what he says, um... Oh, you, He's a pig, I mean, what can I say? Yeah, yeah. No, and you don't support him. No, no, I don't support Donald Trump. I don't support Hillary Clinton. I don't. I don't really support. Of, I, mean, I, don't, I don't. I voted for Bernie, but I don't even really support him either anymore. Uh, but be careful about that. I don't support any sort of rape culture. Like it's hard to know when you are or not. Like even that that introduction of skepticism, despite all of the evidence of like so many women coming forth, like, maybe they liked it. Like that's pretty fucked up. That's. I know that it's. It seems like you're not making a positive statement. You're just saying maybe. Um, well, that, that's. That, it's it's they're they're thinking their in their own bias is like I would absolutely hate it if Donald Trump came on to me, but some people out there might enjoy that, you know. Like how is that? So to them, in in all scenarios, it would be non consensual because if you come they, up and can't, grab somebody by the they can't. They can't. Well, also, him joking about that also doesn't necessarily mean he did it in real life either. Right. That's why he wasn't prosecuted for the big that he is. He, he could be a dick and just be like, oh yeah, you could grab him by the but you can do whatever you want. That still doesn't mean that he actually did that. So we don't fucking know anything. Like, there's, there's like this interesting, uh, uh, I like read some report about him in the 90s and when he was trying to like um, pump up his image in New York, he would like go on all these like dates with attractive women and like wanted to be seen as like a impresario playboy type. Yeah. But like, uh, but then we just kind of, like, once the, the camera's left or something, when they're at dinner, he just like, disappears. It's just like a, a weird way that one might want to, dem like, like show that you're, like, a sexual masculine being in yeah. order to claim some kind of power. It's like a peacock, with a bunch of it's like peacock, right? feather, oh, ruffling. Yeah, because he's aggressive and just claims to sexually assault people, even if he may not actually sexually assault people. Uh, I strongly believe that he has, and... My, mind you, my, my instinct is to believe anyone that comes forward, but it doesn't really matter what I believe. I think that it matters what is provable. At the end of the day, with any, with any, with any claim, just logically speaking, like I can have a belief for, or against, or neutral of that claim, but ultimately, I don't think beliefs matter. I guess it's more just like what's empirically provable. I don't know. Yeah, no. I'll, I'll give you. I'll give you that. I definitely said that in a weird way in context. But I don't know. That doesn't make me like. Pro I don't think that necessarily makes me fucking. Rape culture is a big thing that we're all like, in some ways, a part of, and have to constantly be working against. I think. So like, so some dude rolled up on me with a fucking bottle, like he was gonna smash it on my head. Do you think that's a good way to deal with rape culture? Because I would. I wouldn't think that that would be. I don't know, throw in like M80s and fucking... I'm not gonna disavow. So even like, I can be like, you know what, fuck conservatives and fuck, and, and also like... What's up? You know, I'm just wondering what's happening here. Oh, this is just the other camera I have. <laughs> but I can say, you know what, I don't really like conservatives, but I can also say that I don't approve of what Antifa is doing. I can hold both those positions. And so she was saying, or that person was saying, you stood on that side. So therefore, you are siding with neo-Nazis. And I, I completely disagree with that. I don't think that makes any logical sense whatsoever. You know? In the way that you're calling me to account for 
with like say Antifa tactics, right? That there's there's a way that you know guilt by association. Yeah, no, I asked. You know, well, there yeah, there is some responsibility that we have to like reflect upon the the side that we're on. So like the way that you might side with. I don't think I don't I don't necessarily think you're okay with doing that. I just asked if you were. You know, I don't think I don't I don't think you are. I, I don't I don't like. You know, I'm not going to positively assert that you are okay with bashing people with bottles and shit. You know, I like I don't know. I was talking about the principle of charity, and you know, and assuming that the person that you disagree with is coming from a rational place, they came they came to their conclusions from like a place of reason and logic. I actually, when I was going over to the side of the antifa talking to them, I said that, and they basically were like, "Fuck off, liberal," you know. You know, uh, live streamers fuck off. Live streamers fuck off. So she says you've been on the side of the the uh, Trump supporter Nazis. It's like, well, they're not telling me to fuck off, liberal. Fuck off, uh, you know, live streamer. Fuck off, reporter. Fuck off, white media. Whatever. They, um, I mean, they're okay with liberal values of freedom of speech and freedom of the press and shit like that. The Antifa? No, no, the Trump supporters. <laughs> They're gonna sit there and be like, you know speech is a big I I think so. Or I would support the Antifa people's right to sit in like the collective info shop area and talk about revolution and shit. Just like uh I saw signs about hate speech is free speech. What does that what does that mean? I thought that hate speech is like what is um, excluded from the protections of free speech. <laughs> oh shit, the yeah, eggs. Now I'm, on, uh, uh, now I'm on your side. So I'm gonna have to run. Well, they're gonna. Oh, wait, could you explain that? I think hate. I, I don't. I don't. What does that mean? I don't think hate speech is a thing. I mean, like, not in America. Legally, it's not a thing in America. Um, and I think in Canada and like Germany, it is. In Germany, you can get arrested. It was in <laughs> and and also the way that it's connected to like incitement to violence. I think you can you can get arrested if you directly say go do this to this group or this person. Uh -huh. But if you just say like, I think this group is this, and that's negative against that group, that's not legally hate speech. Or, or like it's not legally like inciting inciting would be like you go do this here's the location uh do this to this group of this person or this entity if I, if I see you again in another one of these things let's both like uh subscribe bitch i remember Darcy's the worst ah!